Today's video is for the Dakar purists. Hi friends, I'm TTB. Welcome back to German Engineering today with the Jägermac S in a quadruple AC5 configuration, high risk, long range domination. Let's go. Like Found a little shitter. I see more shitters. Not a guy there. Nope. Can I just go to here and shoot from there? I wonder. That hit. Somebody just hit my leg as well. Hmm. Problem is my AC5 projectors are fairly slow, so... It must have been double gauss what hit me there, 97%. A light maker trying to cap. Which he won't. Dude, I'm, I'm keep missing. What the? F Where the fuck is this dude that's shooting me? I'm getting crazy. I'm getting crazed out here. Last seven minutes. There. There. Yep. Target spotted. Target spotted. Welcome to the Jägermack experience! Target spotted. Oh, he's gone fast. Target spotted. Target spotted. Ow. They found me! There I was hiding so well, but they found me. They finally found me. We'll have to get a little bit closer to do some more damage here, but we'll see. Nice. But you're not winning this. Got an arm. Now I just need a leg. This guy is so annoying over there. Keep missing. Also we're running lower on ammo, so I need to get closer a little bit, I think. Let's do it. Dude, where are you jumping to? Finally hit. Alright. Uh, what? What are you? Where are you vipering around, good sir? Oh, hello. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. How does he just get to jump on me like that? Give me that arm. Jumps up shits out of you, baby. <laughs> Good. <laughs> One kill, 11 assists, 3 KDDs, 1050 damage done, 450 taken, 4 components destroyed and almost dead. The fuck is it, boss? Oh. 
All right, let's go here. Nothing. Okay. Fine by me. Keep going. See nothing, Delta Three top so far. Need assistance. Pegas going to the low ground, of course. Which means we have to wear off to the side here. I can't look over the center. That would be suicidal. Well then, they must all be downstairs. Affirmative. Target acquired. Target spotted. What just hit me? That's a haggy boy. And that was somebody who hasn't <laughs> discovered the mute button yet. Alright. How does he have locks on me like that? Hmm? Okay, it's fine, we're good. Go back a little bit. Need to control this, this staircase right now, but if I go back here, and go through the center, I can control it from a straight position and even shoot down, which should be better. So let's go there. As enemy team is in Delta 4, Delta 3. Get out of Delta 2 if you can. Thanks. Target spotted. Mm hmm. Target spotted. Let's see if we can find somebody Target below. Spotted. That is a negatory. Artillery the other strike. strike. Dropping artillery strike delta 4 ramp, careful. There's a dash step below us. Target spotted. Maybe even two. Can I see him though? Why can't I see this guy? Is this our guy? So these are our guys shooting, okay. Target spotted. Mm-hmm. I'm stuck. Spotted. Stupid ledge. That was an enemy jump shot right there, right? Oh, I want to be in a good position. Turns out we're not. Maybe we are. Hang on. That was a nice shot in that UV with the side strafe. Skill coming in my way. Move over here for a sec. Target spotted. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Target spotted. Warning. Is this guy ever dying? Okay, we got one side to some left off near. It's gonna be hot now. He fell down, nice. Getting shot from the back now. Almost close to dying. Target destroyed. Still alive, for now. There's the Fafnir again. Alright, ah, too much damage taken earlier. Still, 950 damage is not bad.
You can kill him. Yes, I prepped him. Nice. Now kill him. Oh, he's actually refresh still. Almost. Come on. Oh, he almost had him. Rip. Two KDDs, 950, and two UV kills. Top damage in the match. GG. I was actually surprised how much performance you can get out of this 65 ton machine for how little you can actually put into it. Here is the build on screen, guys. As you can see, we have four AC5s, we've got an XL255 engine, and we have got a total of six tons of ammo. That is it. We can literally not fit anymore. We have NOC structure, double heat sinks, light ferrofibrous armor. No space for anything, legs are shaved a bit, cockpit armor basically non-existent, but you just have to cut these corners, otherwise you can't get the ammo in. Now there might be a way to get even a, a an even lower grade um, engine in if you drop the light ferro and drop down the engine speed to a lot less, but um, I will leave it up to you. This is the build that I ran with and I found that that has sufficient ammo to do some good damage. Now the only reason why this works, because... I mean, let's face it, this is not a clan Jäger mech, uh, so that doesn't exist. There's not a clan rifleman to see, that's what I meant to say. So uh, we don't have the benefits of the uh, tiny clan tech, and uh, so we can't have jump jets with all of this and, and extra plenty of ammo. But what we do have is some strong quirks that kind of mitigate this a little bit, and let's read them. Inner sphere, auto cannon velocity, 15%, ballistic cooldown, 15%, range, 15%, ammo capacity, Plus some extra armor on the arms and some extra structure on CT, left torso, right torso, and the legs. And those crooks kind of help it to not suck. That is good. And um, that makes it kind of viable. Um, you have to be careful, of course, guys. This is an XL mech. You are an XL Inner Sphere Jäger mech. You're a giant box with Dakar arms on legs. By the way, I highly recommend the Buccaneer skin for this. Uh, it isn't, even has a rum on the side, so what is not to like there? Um, but yeah, so <laughs> you are a big target, but here's the thing. If you can see it, you can shoot it. As long as you clear enough ground, left side and right side, as long as you can see it, your weapons are higher than your mech, so you have a really, really nice peaking profile. You want to stick around teammates, don't want to be caught out in the open alone. If you get chased down by a light mech, he's just going to run retarded circles around you and you'll just die. So uh, stick with teammates if possible, hold together with teammates, and uh, just keep on duckying until the ammo runs out, or the enemy runs out, whatever comes first. And of course, guys, two weapon groups, left arm and right arm, that also allows you to shoot down UAVs at 600 meters or so without any problems, so just use one arm for that. Try to build, guys, and let me know how it goes for you. I don't know, there's just something old school and honest about Inner Sphere Jäger Max. What is also old school, honest, and amazing, of course, is the group of my beautiful supporters. Thank you so much, guys. I couldn't do this without you. If you're out there and not a supporter yet but would like to become one, check out the various options. For example, in the video description, you find the link to my Patreon. You can find the link to my merch store. You can grab yourself something nice. Or you can send a super thanks or join the channel right here on YouTube. Whatever you decide, thank you for your support.